Assalamualaikum. Hi everyone. Uh, today I'm going to show some tutor clients that you can install on Ubuntu Linux, right? Um, I've got three to four tutor clients installed, and I'll show you all four and which one totally rocks. All right. First, let me start with just minimize it. Uh, so this client, it looks good, promising, but somehow, um, well. Uh, it's not like perfect. I don't know why. It's not showing me the tweets when it is supposed to show me. Maybe because it is still in development, I guess. Uh, you can change uh, the number of messages per page. Increase so default is 20. You can increase it to as much as you want. And uh, okay, what about miscellaneous tabs? Uh, okay, you have s these many tabs, and you can choose which one to update and which not to update. Hello. As I said, okay, maybe I have to double click it. You can add, mm, well, I guess you can add multiple accounts and uh, you can use a URL shortener proxy and all that. So, as it doesn't work properly as of now, I won't be giving it any rating. Let me use, let me try some other app now. Okay, Twitix. It's very fast and um, it's very simple to install and set up as you can see the settings you just have to like expand messages display notifications you'll you'll get a, a custom notification over here not the Ubuntu notification and default timeline you can choose which one public friends or Twitix it will refresh every three minutes if you want spell checking and languages right uh, sound notification so that's another feature but as far as links are concerned okay you cannot click anything over here but you can like click it will open uh, on Firefox if you click the link sorry about my theme I know some people have complained that I cannot see text properly because of the theme please bear with me as I really don't like changing the themes very often um, any uh, other feature okay I guess uh, you cannot Hold on, if I'll see if uh, whether I can um, refresh more than 20 messages. Well, I cannot receive more than 20 messages. I guess that's the, the disadvantage of this. Uh, you can add a friend, all right, send direct message, new message, and all that. Disconnect and connect. So I'll give it three out of five because it's not amazing. You cannot retweet. You cannot reply anybody. You know, you can reply, but you cannot just click on the tweet and reply so I'll just uh, close this one I'll exit it and another Twitter client it's called G Twitter and um, yes you can you cannot click on the link so you can just read the tweet and uh, not much features it's G, G Twitter 1.0 beta you can install you want this one all those three applications you can install on Synaptic you can search and syn install it mm, okay not much options you can just choose public friends tweet direct that's it nothing much so maybe two out of five because it doesn't have much options preferences let me check that's it sign up every minute hidden at startup and nothing much you can clear cached images I guess cached um, authors so this is the remaining one okay before that I will show you you can use um, Google gadgets right you can use Google gadgets to install a tutor client um, recently used this is the tutor client it's a nice client you can uh, well you know expand it or you can collapse it it will show you the tweets recent tweets or you can even type it in here so you can uh, paste it uh, well you know you can use it on your desktop it will be as a gadget or a widget so that's from Google you can close it and you can uh, um, dock to sidebar if you use a side sidebar always on top or not okay I'll just collapse it another yeah this is another Twitter API right screenlet API and this is from screenlets where is it yeah so we're here 
Come on, launch it, man. Yep. Um, you have to install it. You have to click on. Uh, where is it? Yeah. Get more screenlets, and there, if you search Twitter, you'll get it. Just drag the compressed archive on the screenlet manager, and it will install it automatically. It's simple to use. Twitter point two one screenlet to show Twitter timeline. You can type. Yeah, you can post a tweet. You can tweet, but you cannot do anything else. It will show you, you know, a pop-up, a yellow pop-up, but that's it. A yellow description box. Is that a description box? But you won't, if you click on the username, it will open the whole web page. It won't open this tweet, but it will open the username on uh, uh, Firefox. I will just close this one too. And this one. And lastly, uh, the best app is Gribber 2.0. It's still in development. Okay, 2.0. If you want to install it, you can use this PPA. All right, I'll post the link and um, install this package 2.0 BZR490. It will update every week, I guess, if not daily. And the best thing about it is it's got all the features that the web the normal Twitter web page has. You can click sorry, you can click on the URL automatically, you can retweet it, you can like reply it. You if you click on this, you can retweet, reply, view message, you can like this message, bookmark it, all the stuff. Alright, all you can do all the stuff. You can add multiple accounts. So this is messages. These are the replies. This is okay my home page you can add Facebook friend feed and identity I don't have account in either of this so I won't be showing you that and um, um, you can search and you can oh, as you can see you can add multiple accounts I just saw it now as you, like I said this is one of the best application micro blogging app on Ubuntu you can manage the accounts uh, you can as you can see you can add multiple accounts and all, all that stuff good stuff you can show the editor spell check try icon and not just that if I go to preferences um, display bubbles it will it won't actually display the bubble over here it will use the Ubuntu notification it will minimize to stray tray on close and okay update every minute message it will automatically shorten the pasted URL. So if you paste a YouTube URL, it will automatically shorten it. So that's the nice thing. It's a very nice feature. You have got multiple themes, the dark theme, the compact theme, and uh, the Guilouche team, uh, theme. Okay, that's a nice theme. Mm, apart from that, um, what else do we have? I kind of forgot you can search over here yes as you can see it's got only 20 20 <coughs> um, tweets it won't show more than 20 tweets so if you want to hack it and if you want more than 20 tweets I have this um, I'll just close this right and uh, there's this nice hack which you can uh, install <coughs> I mean which you can modify type this command I'll post it in the description box. All right, we are editing user share, pie shared, gripper, microblog, twitter.py. So we are gonna edit the Python script. Right, use it. Use your g edit, g editor, and just type. You know, press Control F and uh, search for twenty. Right, as you can see over here. Uh, get messages uh, from friends timeline receive account is 20 just add 20,000 <laughs> right 20,000 I guess that's it search again if there is any okay here we have one more search again that's it one two three four all right close it save it and launch it again just click you can just click on uh, the indicator icon and uh, it will launch the Gribber right 
go to messages and now let it refresh as it will take some time because uh, I've asked them to as you can see over here if you go keep on scrolling there are a hundred tweets on this page and you can view more messages so this is one hack and you can actually check around 20,000 <laughs> that's what I specified I guess that's it amazing app you have to check this on see you uh, tomorrow or some other day as well. Malaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.